but as we have company. Just so embarrassed to be seen in this old thing. Don't worry, Blanche, the dress covers most of it. We have spent exactly two Saturday mornings building display booths and painting signs. We're hardly close. Maybe you could be if you'd ask him out. He's obviously too shy to ask you. Maybe he just doesn't like her. <laughs> Thank you, Rose. Incidentally, you look fat. Have you ever heard of something called Dirty Dancing? Well, of course, Blanche. They did it in that movie. What movie? Lawrence of Arabia. Right? <laughs> this flyer that came in the mail says they're going to start a dirty dancing course down at Lawson's Dance Studio. What do you say, Dorothy? Oh, no. I can't see myself swinging my hips and wildly gyrating my pelvis. I am not interested. <laughs> And the world heaves a collective sigh of relief. <laughs> oh, Dorothy, good God, you were cleaning out the garage and you asked Sophia to move a sofa? Don't start with me. I mean, she is 84 years old and you're asking her to do the work of two men? Blanche, leave her alone. I'm sure she feels bad enough. Thank you, Rose. Oh, honey, do we have any orange juice? Sure. Would you like me to pour you a glass or have Sophia come in and bring you the refrigerator? <laughs> Hi, what are y'all doing here? Uh, Russell and I just uh, entered the dance marathon. Really? So did I. Yes. It's for charity. I thought it would be fun. Uh-huh. Well, have yourself a good time and try not to overdo it. Uh, Blanche, <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Oh, nothing. It's just that these things can be a little strenuous for a woman of your years. <laughs> <laughs> Who am I? Mimi Eisenhower? <laughs> I can last just as long as you can. Oh, Dorothy, please. I think I do have a little more endurance than you. Blanche, we are not dancing on our backs. <laughs> you take that back. I will not. You just implied that I'm an old lady. Oh, well, honey, I didn't mean to imply it. I meant to say it flat out. <laughs> oh, Rose, Rose, what are you doing? Oh, she can't face me. She's been doing this all day. Rose, you know I said I'm sorry. Can't you put yourself in my position? <laughs> Apparently, I'm not limber enough. <laughs> that was good. Wow, what a hump. I know. Eat your hearts out. <laughs> Blanche, did it ever occur to you that possibly Rose or I might be interested in Jay? Yes. And you still used every cheap ploy to nab him before we had a chance? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> then what do you have to say for yourself? Damn, I'm good. I wish men would have breasts just for one day. <laughs> then they'd know what it's like to be judged by some physical trait. <sighs> I mean, just because I'm built like this, you wouldn't believe how many people think I'm dumb. <laughs> Rose, you're too hot on yourself. I know people who think you're dumb over the phone. Hey, right, girls, which goes better, the silver chain or the pearls? The chain. An amateur's mistake. Can't you see that the chain accentuates the many folds of that turkey-like neck? <laughs> Maybe, but the pearls draw attention to the non-existent bosom. <laughs> yes, but the chain leads the eye even lower to that huge spare tire. <laughs> Jutting out over those square, manly hips. Why don't I just wear a sign that says, too ugly to live? <laughs> Fine, but what are you gonna hang it from, the chain or the pearl? Neither. I'm going to spray paint it on my hump. <laughs> well, I'm off. If you need something to keep you occupied tonight, Rose, why don't you take out a good book and see if you can find Waldo? <laughs> I've never liked her. 